So we're gonna react to it. I know for a fact that Furina is gonna be able to finally unleash her true colors on this version. She's gonna be a banner character. Alongside Baizu, I saw some stuff on social media and it wasn't really a big deal. And Charlotte's along with their banner. And for the second half, I forgot the second half honestly, but here's my dilemma. Oh wait, I remember Ayato being on the second half. Okay, so here's my dilemma. I don't know if I should pull for Furina or if I should pull for Baizu in order to support New Villain. I'm gonna have to see Furina's kit in order for me to make uh, my decision. But obviously, uh, Furina is gonna be the better option because she's an Archon. We're not sure about that yet if she's the true Hydro Archon, but that's most probably what I'm leaning towards. Alright, so without further ado, without further talk, let's get right into it. According to the judgment of the Oratrice Mechanique de Malise Cardinal, the Hydro are come to be punished via the death sentence. Ooh, now that's what I'm looking for. Obviously, she's not gonna die. Judging by the you track record of Foilverse. There may be issues with the Primordial Sea. Everyone on the street who happened to be close to the water didn't have a chance to escape. As right, the water that's a new rose, area, I think. They suddenly disappeared. Shouldn't gods be all powerful? What's done is done. Just trust in me. You're Archon. Never mind whether you can truly convince yourself to or not. Sword user. The show begins. Oh. Shower me with praise. Ooh. Let my name echo in song. There she is, Charlotte. I don't know what her role is. Oh yeah, I saw this back then. I know you're not a local, but I'd avoid getting too close to any water that looks strange all the same. There's something ominous about it. Ah, she's the back. Water, I mean. I forgot her name. The prophecy. Yes. What has been prophesized will be fulfilled. I, Marina, will you, use boss. The trial to show the world the true do not resist. Justice. This judgment is Wait, fair. They are so just. What is the meaning you would call this? You have this never been as justice. superficial as you have presented yourself Your to be. No God. more excuses. And why should we acknowledge it? For so long. Why did you deceive us? Applaud and rejoice. Wait just a moment. This isn't right. The trial of the Hydro Archon. To the floor will now begin. This trial is I now understand the true purpose behind this position. Whoa! Oh, wait, wait, wait. That's actually cool. Devious one. It's a child. Everyone's dead. Papa, what should I do? That's a boss, isn't it? The prophecy that you've been fretting over should now be in full swing. It's gonna be a weekly boss. <laughs> I suppose this would also be the justice that belongs to you. All will eventually a end one. in a magnificent and dramatic trial. Farewell, Nervalette. I hope you've enjoyed the part you played these 500 years. Um, Farina increases the damage and the incoming healing bonus of nearby party members based on the amount of fanfare she has. Wow, okay. it seems like this fighting so there's style a bonus really to the damage. The Obviously, very that's, showy and that's a plus right there already. Totally. Story do you really need to, to do a charge attack in order for ah, amazing. Mm, switch stances okay. there? That could be She's problematic. Now, now her elemental burst creates a news flash field that continuously restores HP to party members within its range. Monsieur Verite, he's also going to join in and intermittently attack opponents during the duration of the ability. Oh, well, that's a short As an one. When paired with non-Fontaine characters, she receives a cryo damage bonus. Uh, 
Now that is not that is way all. Too there short. is more. So Farina and Charlotte yeah, will both I saw be this. featured in version mm. 4.2 event wishes. I could advise you. In the first half of or version 4.2, we'll have but event Farina wishes could also work in hyper Farina setting. and Baiju. During this time, Charlotte will also receive a huge drop rate boost. Huge boost. <laughs> Huge boost. A new five star sword, Splendor of Tranquil Waters, yeah, will be featured in, right in the weapon event banner. Huge and. Sword. <laughs> it would be too risky and to pull up the banner. The second half of version 4.2, oh, si we'll have reruns for Sino and Ayata. Sino's here. Hmm. Yeah, no one's gonna pull Sino. Oh, there's even Sorry a to break it to you. Uh, it's pretty feeling, slow. Uh, that this isn't the type of opponent that we can just brute force our way through, you know? Mm -mm. Exactly. It should be tanky, right? In the right? first phase, it will use its gigantic size to target the traveler. Yeah, this is exactly the team I want to make right here. Dodging is definitely your friend with this one. It's gonna be a Ooh, problem, boy. though. Um, Okay, okay, okay. Who should I so go there for? there also seems to be sort of a progress bar next to the boss's HP mm, bar. Yeah. What's that for? Okay, since we can't outfight it, we'll have to outsmart it instead. The creature just freed itself from captivity and is brimming with anger. Maybe I should so go. So if you can All find right. a way to uh, capitalize on that anger, I don't know how much I have. You'll also find its weaknesses. Mm. I'm probably oh, gonna okay. be able to tell Wait, it is, is once somebody I. Being eaten? Is uh, it? See how many wishes I have. Something like that. <laughs> What's happened I guess there? Here it is. Wait, that's Ooh. a second phase or something? This is an entirely different space, it looks like. And there's a new enemy here with a massive sword. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Who is Ooh, that? These summoned creatures also look vaguely familiar to me. I wonder what the deal is with all of this. Perhaps defeating this mysterious enemy within this space will be the key to defeating the whale? Travelers will need to experiment for themselves. Who knew she did all this work behind the yeah, scenes? Yeah, area, I knew it. certainly didn't. <laughs> well, you know, maybe she's just using area it as an excuse to scout out a place. One. A strong windstorm has gathered around the vortex, rising yeah, it's gonna from be the another of world quest it's right there. It's almost like it's preventing certain things from getting closer and forcibly pushing other things away. To learn more about the story behind the new Erinius Forest region, be sure to check out the version 4.2 world quest called yeah, the Wild Fairy of Erinius. It. I'll give you a hint. Melazines are involved. A prophesied earthquake woke up new life forms in other yeah, places. Another boss. Cool looking boss so though. Fontaine to promote oh, this one again. Little Fungi's fantastic fiesta. Travelers will be able to command a variety of fungi, boring. adjusting their movement it's to target slow. different enemies. Powerful Sorry, skills. but yeah. that's honestly how Travelers I feel about it. Travelers who are at adventure rank 40 or above will have the option to quick challenge a weekly boss by navigating to the Trounce Domain section of the Adventure Handbook. All right, that's good. That's All good right there. Bosses will be available to challenge, except Storm Terror and the Wolf of the North. <laughs> nice. Um, yeah, now we don't have to wait to advance the story before we can level up a new character's talents and skills. Yeah, that's really, exactly. really good optimization. So we're introducing an update to Genius yeah, I don't care about this one. TCG. Returning travelers will enjoy ample login rewards and exploration guidance courtesy of the Genshin Impact Project team. May those returning to Devat have a happy reunion. Aww, All right, that's, that's nice. good yeah. right there. Plus, a new story key privilege has also been added so that returning travelers can enjoy new story quests and hangout events. Ooh, ooh. Yeah. <laughs> Amazing. There's a lot. Red notification and I dots have also been any of those ever since. But yeah, I'm going to have to end it there. I'm not too excited about it, but I did see that Purina is indeed... It seems like she's a really strong support for New Villette since they said one of her abilities was that if a party member were to gain or lose hp they would gain more damage so that's a dedicated support for a new villette right there so i'm contemplating with whether i should go for it or not because that's guaranteed bonus damage for new villette on the other hand though baiju would be a universal unit not really on every party or team but every party or team that will try to use Quicken, Aggravate, and all the danger related reactions. He's just one of the most essential ones since he provides uh, resistance to interruption, which is a really, really huge uh, buff right there. So I'm on the fence whether I should go Baiju or Furina. It depends on how many wishes I have. If I have enough for like uh, more than 90, let's say, then I'd probably go. 
pull on the weapon banner and whoever whomever's weapon I get that's the person I'm gonna pull as for the Archon Quest the Archon Quest seemed uh, seemed like it would take a really really dark turn but I'm not expecting something so tragic considering how Oyoverse uh, played with the characters in previous Arkham Quests. They haven't killed a major character, a major playable character at least, yet. So I'm keeping my hopes uh, on the bare minimum and I'm not really gonna hype it up too much. We'll see in the actual one because to be honest, uh, uh, Act 3 and 4 of the Arkham Quest were pretty tame. They were not that exciting. The only exciting thing that occurred there was when Nuvelet went ahead and froze the primordial waters. He sealed them away. Uh, that, that was the probably the most hyped thing about those two sequences. Just about it. It, it was just standard visit to the prison stuff and informing you about the backstory of the fortress of Meribid and shit like that. It wasn't too intense. It was pretty pretty mediocre I'm gonna say so I don't know my hopes are pretty low on this one but let's hope that Hoyoverse comes to shock me again but anyways um, I'm not too hyped about any of the events it's just standard stuff again standard mini games and that's about it I guess so I'm gonna end it there uh, thanks everybody for watching and as always I'll see you in the next one stay safe everyone